everyone, it's Miranda. Welcome back to my channel. Today's gonna be a short and sweet video. I'm gonna show you how to do this cheetah print cut crease. Um, I actually did this on my Instagram a little while ago, and I thought that I would make a more in-depth video to show you how to recreate it. So if you wanna know how to do it yourself, just keep watching. So for this look, I'm using the new Maybelline Master Precise Ink Metallic Liquid Liner in the shades Stellar Sand and Black Comet, but I'm going to start out with the black. So I'm going to start this look as if I were just going to be doing a very thin winged liner. So I'm bringing the liner across my upper lash line towards the corner, and then I'm going to keep the wing to a little bit of a smaller size just to start out with because obviously you can always build, you can't take away. When I'm ready for the flick of the wing, I'm going to actually flick it a little bit inward and upward, and then I'm gonna start the cheetah print pattern. So basically, cheetah or leopard print is a bunch of like parentheses shapes. That's how I like to draw them. It's like an easy way to get that look. So you basically make these bendy lines that face each other, and sometimes they can connect at one side, sometimes they can be a little bit off kilter. You can kind of play around with it to how you like it to look. I like to give a little bit of variety to my spots so that it's just not the same throughout the whole pattern. I also like to add dots here and there to fill in the space. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this basically in a cut crease shape. So it's gonna be sweeping right over my natural crease. You don't wanna put this in your crease because then if you open your eye, you'll probably smudge the liner. Although this stuff actually doesn't move. I mean, like you can set it and forget it, but still you want to be able to see it when your eyes are open. So we're gonna do it above the crease. So here's where we're at with the outline of our cheetah print and now we're going to go ahead with that sand beige color and fill in the spots. So I'm just kind of putting in some light strokes between the lines that we drew or filling in the space between them. So this is going to give it that nice metallic shine and really bring the pattern to life. And that is literally it. It's so easy. I just added some false lashes to finish the look and I'm done. So you can do this on both eyes. You can do like an asymmetrical look and just rock a regular winged liner on the other eye. Whatever you want to do, I think this look is fierce. If you liked this and you want me to do some more graphic liner or just creative looks, hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, be sure to hit subscribe, become a member of the Slashed Squad. I make new videos every Saturday and sometimes in the middle of the week. And I hope to see you in my next one. Bye.